What's going on, you guys? Laxo here again. All right, so it looks like we've finally gotten our summertime event. Everybody's been talking about it. Everybody's been excited for a long time. So let's go ahead and hop right in here and check it out. All right, so it looks like we're, we have the same little icon as I think last season, or maybe it was two seasons ago, or sorry, summers ago. We have the ice cream cone. So let's actually just look at the free pulls that we get here. We get two, four, six, I believe we get 10. So we get 10 from just logging in for our 14 days. And then we get an extra, let's see here, six days times four. So six, 12. So we get an extra 24 here. And then we get an extra five here. So that would be uh, 24, 34, 39. So we get roughly about 40 free pulls. And then again, every probably a couple days into the event that every you will get a box that gives you a bunch of free random stuff. And typically you get either like you get a bunch of jades, uh, all that stuff. And typically you get around six, seven, eight, maybe like 10 free pulls from that. Not, not including that they give you just a bunch of free jades as well. So I'm going to assume that we get those. So that would put our total free pulls around... 45 maybe 50 i'm gonna say 45 maybe 50 is where we get our free pulls from so as you can see went ahead and grabbed our 45 free pulls here that's going to represent our free pulls for the for the uh, event and before we get into it let's actually look at a couple things here so let's see what we have here two war souls i'm gonna go after all this stuff i'm gonna go over it after the video just so I don't break into our pull time too much. I'm going to assume that we're getting the same basic things here from these. That's always nice. Ten more. Okay. Damage rate of all allies. Okay. So yeah, I think... 5% extra damage rate is pretty nice. Although I really do think that these are underrated. You definitely need some. You definitely need a lot of those. However, do I see the jades anywhere? Did we not get any? Oh, they replaced the jades for soul orbs. I'm sorry. Omni shards. Looks like we're going to get 5 omni shards instead of 10. We're going to get 5 soul orbs instead of 10 omni shards. Ugh, that is rough. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and hop right into it here and start with the poles. All right. So I believe last time we did this, a oh, pretty good start, 10 there, pretty good start. I believe the last time we did this, it took us 110, maybe 100 and, 110, 112, somewhere like that around poles to get 70 shards. So I'm going to assume it's going to cost around the same thing. Let's say 120. A lot of people have complained a lot and been like, oh, it took me... 200 pulls and i'm like yeah i don't really believe that for a second you know so i guess that's the thing let's see here what are we at for just the free pulls alone 24 not bad so yeah i think the most it's ever taken me on any singular event to get 70 shards was probably what i want to say 130 it took me the most it's ever taken me to get Nice. The most it's ever taken me to get 70 shards was like 130, 135, somewhere around there. So I'm going to assume and cross my fingers and hope it takes me maybe one, one, two, oh, look at this huge 22 plus five. Oh, geez. This is going to be like my best pull yet. Take a, take a look at this, guys. Jeez. All right. We are at, we only need 11, 12, 13 more. Let's check it out. None there. I think that was the first one we've got none on, maybe. All right. So we need 11 more. Come on. Two, four. So we need seven more. And this is actually taking quite a bit. Five, six, seven. Okay, boom. We're done right there. So minus one from our total pulls. So 139. It took us 139 pulls to get Cura. That is actually a lot more than it usually takes us. All right, let's go ahead and take a note really quickly here. 
So it took us 139 pulls, which equals, let's do some jade count in here. By the way, once again, guys, make sure you have your rebate before you do this because it's going to save you, what, 25, 30%? So definitely want to do that. All right, so let's see where I'm at here. So I am at 33,821. So let's actually open up my calculator. So minus 33,821. Took me 19,680 jades. Actually, minus one pull, so plus 300, I guess. So, 19,380 jades. Uh, let's see here. Right there. 19680. To get Kira's 70 shards. Which is a bit more than usual. That is actually a bit more than usual. And if we were to get the... Let's see here. If we were to get the... The free... one, The free 30 pulls. So let's take off an extra 9,000. So it would take us... Let's see here. Free. Or I'm sorry. Uh, $1 spent. It would be minus... 9,000, which would be 10,680 jades with the one, with the one free pull. I'm sorry, with the $1 a day for 30 free pulls. 10,680, not bad. Let's go ahead and see what it takes us for the weapon now. Go ahead and hop right into that. Also got a Clean these here. I want to make sure I count these towards our. So at 100 and. How many do I have right now? 33. So I need. What? 12 more? I need 12 more of these shells. That's nice. We can actually keep the shells from last time that we didn't get a spend. So let's continue on. I need 12 more. Jeez, look at this one, guys. 19 shards there. Oof, good one. So 11. Minus six is five. Need one more five drop and we got it. So I need three more. Yeah, there it is right there. Okay. So with minus two from this, it is, we're at 200, so it took us 198 pulls. I'll just do 198 pulls and continue on with the video, and we could uh, get back to that later. 15, 8, 21. Actually, you know what? Might as well just do the math now real quick. All right, so now we're at 21, 221. Minus 21, 221. So it took us an extra 12 KJs to get the weapon. Is that right? Let's see. 
Yep, so it looks like it took us... What? About... It took us about, what, 31k? Let's just say 31k jades. Alright, so as you can see here, it took roughly... So with the free pulls, that would be minus 9k, so it would have been... 22k jades. So as you can see here, these are our final numbers here. I'm going to go back to them after we finish the polls because I don't want this video to last too long here. Sorry for all the quick cuts here, by the way. Nice, 10, 12 there, that's good. And I think this will probably do it here at 250. Another one, dude, geez, 12 more. All right, let's take a look at... All right, actually, let's do... Do 260, there you go, 260. That pole is kind of garbage. Okay, there it is. All right, not bad. Let's take a look here at our at our total. So we got 66, we got 66 of these and we had what, 179 or so cure shards? Let's see. So 146 cure shards with 146 cure shards with 200 and 260 pulls. That's pretty good. Usually it's a, it's at about a two to one ratio or a little bit higher than a two to one ratio. So that's actually pretty solid. Anyways, with that being done, let's just claim my jades back. I definitely capped out, didn't I? Yeah, I definitely capped out, I think. All right, cool. I capped out. All right. So, that's going to be it for all the jades that I spend on this event. Maybe I'll do some more jades later, maybe. Or each day I'll do a couple more jades just to cap out as well on my dailies. Alright, let's go ahead and go over the war souls and everything like that now. Alright, not bad. That was not bad. Alright, so, war soul of the board. Increase attack by... 450 plus 3.6% rage attacks reduce the defense of targets by 10% and have a 50% chance of increasing rage attack damage by 5%. Okay. It has finished. Okay. That actually doesn't sound too bad. I'll have to get into that a bit later. Really break it down. Whenever a character is damaged by the rage attack, they gain 10% increased block chance. This... Ooh, very nice. Yo, this is huge. Oh, whenever a character is damaged, so I'm... S Actually, zero damage is still damage, so... This might not be bad on somebody like Sodeno, j so we can get that zero proc. Increase it by 10. Although I'm sure it's like 40 or something like that, maxed. When Rage Attack is finished. Right, and we had the other Warsaw, which was the 5% increased damage rate. So all of those things are looking pretty nice. That's actually really exciting. But anyways, you guys, I think that is actually going to do it for this one here. I'm pretty excited. I think it's pretty good. Pretty cool. Um, we didn't get free Kira shards, obviously. But, uh, kind of a bummer. They gave us soul orbs here and soul orbs over here as well. That's unfortunate. Anyways, guys, I think it's actually going to do it for this one. These are my total numbers right here. Summer event, it took me, uh, let's see here, to get 70 shards. It took me 139 pulls, which is a lot more than usual. That's really unfortunate. I'll actually do my free-to-play profile as well. 
and uh, see how that works, actually. See how I see if I can get better than 139, because that's really high. Which is equivalent to 9,680 jades, or if you do the $1 a day, then it's equivalent to 10,680. So do the $1 a day, and it only costs you roughly 10,000, probably less to get that. So your weapons for, or so jades for the weapons took me 198 pulls, which is equivalent to 31k jades. I think that's right. Maybe it was like 32. I'm going to go with 32. Just to be safe. Let's just say 32k jades. And for the paid, let's just say 23k. So 23k jades to get the character and the weapon. And 32k to get the character and the weapon as an as a zero dollars down so not bad i hope you guys have better luck than me because unfortunately that was kind of low but i think my overall pulls were pretty good after i got here i ended up uh getting a couple like what 20 plus shards which was really nice but yeah not bad anyways guys, that's actually gonna do it for this one and if you guys haven't already subscribed hit that subscribe button down at the bottom i would appreciate it if you guys enjoy this content hit that like button as well and I will do much more content like this as well. And I will do some testing here in the next video. I got to combine him, build him, and get going on that as well. So expect all those videos tonight. Arena testing, everything. And we'll see how that goes. All right, guys, I'll do for this one. Catch you on the next one.